$1.7 billion was stolen by crypto fraudsters in 2023. And most of it is the money of small investors and crypto beginners. In 2024, this amount promises to be much higher. Tinder, AI, meme coins, and other types of fraud rob us ordinary enthusiasts of millions of dollars every day. And the teams working on cryptocurrency security are inventing new ways to protect our money and peace of mind every day. So, I have prepared for you an overview of top three crypto fraud schemes that experts predict in 2024 and life hacks on how to protect yourself from them. And the first type of scam is fake tokens. Scammers play on FOMO by creating token names that impersonate cryptocurrency companies and projects that have not yet launched tokens. Some examples of such tokens are WiseWealth, RabbitRun, DreamFi and BlockFence. Taking advantage of the meme coin trend, fraudsters have also created tokens with similar names, such as AI Pepe, Purple Pepe, Pepe Chain, Pepe Race, and Baby Pepe. Once hype levels are high and the project has access to their liquidity, the organizers have two options. They can either sell their tokens at a high price and remove all their liquidity, or they can use Blackdoor and smart contracts to steal investor funds. Without sufficient liquidity, investors struggle to sell their tokens or are forced to sell them at a low price. With the advent of artificial intelligence, it has become even easier for fraudsters to carry out their schemes. After all, AI generates some of the necessary documents for them. Common size of fake coins include a high token price that skyrockets in a short period of time without any liquidity protection. If project owners can withdraw their funds immediately or very soon after the launch of the project, there is the potential for a rug pull, that is, withdrawal of support. There is also likely to be a lot of investor hype via Twitter, Telegram or other social media platforms. To protect yourself from rug pulls, be sure to do through project research. There is already a video with detailed instructions on our channel, which you can watch. The scammers created thousands of tokens automatically, implementing the following functions to their smart contracts, which each by itself should be a red light. Faking token max supply, the token owner can burn holders tokens, infinite minting for admins, LP tokens lock, hidden contracts. The next type of fraud is romantic. Yes, you heard right. Everyone has seen the movie The Tinder Swindler, right? If it works with fiat money, why wouldn't it work with crypto? Romance scammers are experts in social manipulation. They deceive their victims by playing on emotions and creating attractive profiles that speak to the victims. You think you've got your romantic relationship on track? And now your counterpart asks for some money due to an unexpected situation. Can you refuse a person with whom you are about to fall in love? Of course not. But still, pay attention to a few red flags of a romantic scammer. And if you find them in your online romance, run. There may be inconsistencies in scammers' profiles. For example, they claim to be from Canada, but write in very poor English. They fill the victim with words like you're my angel, and may even start a conversation about marriage and children. Having gained their victim's trust, they ask for money for unforeseen expenses, for insurance, a sick relative, a funeral, business problems, etc. If the victim does not send money immediately, the messages become more desperate, so that you start to hesitate. What is more precious to you, money or a person to whom you have become attached? The life of a fraudster can often resemble a soap opera, so they often talk about angry competitors who want to kill them. Scammers often claim to be traveling or working abroad to have an excuse not to meet with victims in person. Intruders always have an excuse for why they can't make it to the meeting, why they need more money, or why they can't return the money. Sometimes scammers suggest moving to a more private chat instead of the dating site to stay under the radar of moderators. Each of these signs is a reason to wonder if you are being used by a charming stranger or a stranger to steal your assets. And the third scam I'd like to focus on is the cryptocurrency ransomware scam. It occurs when hackers use malware to take over your device or account, encrypt it, 
and then demand a payment in cryptocurrency for the decryption key. According to security intelligence, ransomware attacks cost companies more than $456 million in 2022. Ransomware fraud is dangerous because it leads to data loss or leakage, which harms users and companies. That's why it's important to develop a robust cybersecurity strategy that requires a comprehensive approach, including conducting risk assessments, reviewing security policies, and using updated software and VPNs. And never forget to back up your data. Unfortunately, fraudsters have the ability to decrypt encrypted accounts and data, including backups. In this case, report the attack to the authorities and consult cybersecurity experts immediately. Here are some tips to help you stay safe when working with blockchain. Keep your credentials, namely your mnemonic phrase and private key secret. Check whether the protocol you are using has been audited. This does not guarantee 100% security, but it will show you how much the contract owners care about security. Check the result of transactions before sending them to the blockchain. Always be on the lookout for phishing attacks by using link checking tools and checking community reviews of unknown websites. Use a secure VPN. Use a secure crypto wallet such as MetaMask, WebMobile, Trust Wallet Mobile, or Ledger physical device. Do not use tokens of unknown origin. This can lead to loss of control over the wallet. It may sound scary, but what I mean is that in 2024, you should expect cyber threats at every turn. However, simple rules will save your crypto from fraudsters. Be vigilant and remember that your money is your responsibility.